Headline News Update. Good morning, everybody. I'm Tommy O'Brien, coming to you live from TFNN headquarters in St. Petersburg, Florida. It's Tuesday, 9 a.m. Eastern Time, 30 minutes to go until that opening bell. And we got markets right around flat territory right now. Dow futures up five points right now. That's after a record close yesterday in the Dow. Dow Jones futures trading 27,665. S&P futures flat, trading at 3,087. NASDAQ futures positive by three, trading at 8,253. We got the note in the bond market back open today after being closed yesterday for Veterans Day. Notes and bonds flat. The 10-year yield yielding 1.93% right now. We've got oil up 30 cents at 57.17. We got the gold contract right now down $4.20 at 14.52. Gold actually making it with a 14.49 handle yesterday. We'll start things off. We'll jump over to the charts. We'll start it off with the indices. Dow Jones trading 27,670. Actually made it up to a high at about 1 a.m. of 27,715. There's your NASDAQ 100 trading at 82.55. The high at a similar time of 82.73, just after 1 a.m. Eastern Time. S&P 500 trading at 3,088, reached a high of 3,093.87. The high on that future, intraday even, or overnight, not closing, the high overall, 3,097. So right up near those highs for the S&P. Crude oil market, $57.19 right now. There's your gold contract, actually eked into a 14.49 print at 1 a.m., Gold trading at 14.55 right now, and the Euro US dollar trading at 1.1021. In terms of what else you have happening today, big day for Disney and their future as they launch their Disney Plus streaming service. So that launching today, they're gonna have a plethora of different titles from their history, betting big on the nostalgia for Disney Plus. They also have the bundle that you can get for Hulu and ESPN Plus. Pretty affordable pricing, whether it's $6.99, I believe, for Disney Plus. You package them all together, you get $12.99. Jumping over to the Disney chart this morning. This is an hourly chart we're looking at. And you see Disney looking to open at about 138. Closed yesterday at 136.74. Actually hit a high of 141.84 overnight after their earnings. Other news, Tyson Foods out with their earnings. Looking to open lower, 81.75. And you also got D.H. Horton out with their earnings as well. Looking to open higher, 5407, closed at 5265. Stay tuned, folks. Larry Pesavento coming up live with Trade What You See at 9 a.m. I'll be back at 10 o'clock with Tom. Live programming all day at TFNet. We'll be right back. <laughs>